Hi, my name is Henry Kruse and I'm a project manager here at ABB Robotics. This is ABB's new controller V250 XT, where XT stands for extra tough. It uses the same flex pendant as the other Omnicore controllers. This is a 250 liter cabinet with a height of 960 millimeters, including lifting beams and foot. The depth is 480 millimeter and the width is 650 millimeters. This is the main switch used for turning the controller on and off. And this is the indicator light showing the status of the controller. The cooling system with fans and cooling channel is in the back of the cabinet. Now let's have a look inside the controller. This is the power module. It supports three phase input from 380 to 480 volt. One new feature is that the access computer is removed. Instead, the functionality is included in the main drive unit. The computer system is the same as in our other Omnicore controllers and comes with a lot of networking capabilities. The VAN port is used for the plant network. The LAN port is used for the cell network. And the management port is used for troubleshooting and commissioning. Finally, the ABB ability port can be connected to the plant network or to the internet. Moving on, the controller supports the field buses, Profinet, DeviceNet and Ethernet IP. Let's talk about functional safety. The safety controller is standard in all Omnicore controllers. This means that all hardware you need is already built in, including the safe room card. The controller supports a scalable modular I.O. system with one digital base module. Add-on modules can then be connected to this base module. The I.O. system includes both digital and analog modules that can be joined together without tools to form a system block. What about the Omnicore safety system? The emergency stop is located on the flex panel. The protective stop function can be active in either manual or automatic mode. I hope this walkthrough has been of interest. I thank you for your attention.